I'm scared. Y'all scared with me? Oh, one, two, three. Oh, welcome back to my channel. <laughs> so today, if y'all can see by the title, we are going to be trying the Good Molecules Niacinamide Brightening Toner. Yes, you guys, you heard that right. Niacinamide Brightening Toner. There is actually a serum that this goes with. Instead of using the serum, I'm going to be doing a mask three days a week. So I'm going to be doing it Monday nights, Wednesday nights, and Friday nights until I get my, I want my skin clear. And it's all about consistency, you guys. It's all about consistency and just being confident about it and just doing it. Just do it. Just do it. Just do it. Just do it. I have to tell myself that all the time. Just do it. I just got done cleaning my face. Right now, my current cleansers, because I do double cleanse my Nyxema, and then I go in with my down soap. Please excuse the soap, but it's just what I go in with. Anyway, so we're going to go in with this, and if y'all, y'all have seen it, the videos already. If not mine, y'all seen somebody's. So I'm just going to mix it, make sure you shake, 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 shake the little minutes later hey y'all i'm back look at my face i'm just, okay can we just take a moment to appreciate the process like you guys my face has never been terrible i've always had acne and the acne with dark marks but it's like now that i know how to get rid of both the acne and the dark marks i could play the game too oh if y'all haven't already y'all can go check out this if I'm being completely honest, if y'all don't just go buy you some lip gloss from the Dollar Tree or the hair store and call it a day, let's look at my face. It's, it's a little bumpy. Uh, don't get me wrong, it's a little bumpy. Compared to how I looked a, a while ago, this is pretty, this is pretty decent. So on the box, it says how to layer. So of course you cleanse first, which we did. Then you go in with the toner and then you go in with the treat and moisturize and SPF. So that's only two, steps three and steps five are gonna be the only thing that I kind of switch up in my routine. It's a pretty nice size, I must admit. It's actually sealed on there with some Mido. So we need to take that off and I'm pretty sure it's like, it's like a hole and you Ooh, don't get me old, y'all. Yeah, so it's like a little hole. And then we're just gonna put it. I know with the other one, it actually had like the dropper, and that's kind of why I wanted the other one. But to be honest with you, if I could just take this out, I've got a dropper. I'm scared. Y'all scared with me? Oh, one, two, three. Oh. That probably was not enough. It's probably better to like put it on your hands, right? And then like rub it on your face. Cause um I don't want it to like, you know what I mean? Like it has no smell to it, so that's actually lovely. And I'm just gonna pat that into my face. So a lot of people said that this broke them out, so we'll see what my face looks like in the morning or tomorrow. Now, I would've got the travel size one, but it was actually cheaper to just get this one. Anyways, and then we're gonna go with the moisturizer. That is night one, you guys, here in my face. I love my face right now. I'm like falling back in love with my skin. But yeah, so I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Hi y'all, so welcome back to night two. I'm just so excited because my face is looking amazing right now it is looking stripped and dry because it is we just cleansed it so now we are going to replenish it y'all so you know we got the bam the nice and my brightness on the bam 
I'm trying to debate. So the direction says dispense onto a cotton pad and gently sweep over clean skin. Oh, it says can also be dispensed into palm and patted into skin into food. Never mind. Never mind. We know what you're doing. But y'all just finna say, I really like when I just dip it in my hands, my hands, and just pat it on my face. Like before we do that, let me tell you guys what I noticed at this morning when I woke up. I noticed that my skin was a little bit more oily than it normally is. That mainly just means that I used too much of a product. Being the fact that the only new product I added was the niacinamide toner, I'm gonna say that that's the culprit. So with that being said, we're gonna try to do, cause normally you do like three drops. Like you know if you do a drop where you do one drop here, one drop here, one drop here. So what I'm thinking to do is like literally drop it into my palm and then just kind of dab, pat, dab, pat. Okay, I did five. Dab, pat, dab, pat, dab, pat, dab, pat, and then I'm gonna do that, and then I'm just gonna pat that into my face, cause I know yesterday I did a lot. I just know we used too much yesterday cause I woke up with an extremely oily face. So what I like to do is, y'all, it's the same routine as been in the last pretty previous videos. I like to go on with my uh Noxzema for about three to five minutes wear it as a mask just to get any oils that's on my face and then after that i'll go with my dowel soap and then after the dowel soap that's when we do the toner after the toner we do the moisturizer and then somewhere in there i make sure my lips look good i'm gonna tell y'all it's living up to the brightening toner now as far as niacinamide we don't know just yet we haven't been using it that long I'm thinking I'm gonna give you guys like an update when I do like my skincare routine after I've been using it for like three weeks. So I'm gonna give you guys an actual update. Yeah. So I see you guys tomorrow. Hey guys, here's my man. He wanted to be in the video, so yeah. Do that. Hey guys, so it is actually so it's day three. It's Wednesday. We got two more days because we're gonna be on friday and i made my mixture already i don't know if y'all can tell but they are literally fading and this was the worst side so i, I mean I, I i like it so far hey y'all so now y'all know the deal we're gonna go in with this bad boy again so i actually learned i like to dip it in my hands and then pat it on my face and i did learn that last night five was too much but i must admit i did not wake up with an oily face but three drops or maybe even four might be perfect because i know you do like one drop per quadrant but like y'all know it's just put it on mainly focusing where there's like active acne. I'm just gonna pat it in. Cause remember we're gonna yeah, and then I'm gonna go in with my moisturizer. I'm just gonna massage. Massage it all over my face and just look at that like my face gets brighter in an instinct. And just a spoiler alert, I'm gonna do a three week update for you guys. So in three weeks, I'm going to do like my skincare routine. And then, yeah, that's gonna be my update on it. All right, here's what I've seen. It's been working and here's what has not been working. But consistency is the key. See you tomorrow. <laughs> hey y'all, so I just 
So I'm actually on my phone today because my camera is actually being used to record another video right now and I just didn't want to go through all that. Okay. So anyways, um my hair is my face, it is wet. I'm gonna go in with the toner. Like it like it literally brightens on impact. Like I put it on my whole face, just just bright. That's really good though. Moisturizing. It definitely gets better within the weeks, but maybe I just need to add sunscreen to my routine. Anyways, I see you guys tomorrow. Hey y'all, so the mask is on and it's time to wipe it off and then we're going to put this on. And honestly, the mask duo and this duo and sunscreen and yeah. Let me wipe this off. I must admit, I definitely see the hyper good molecules. I learned my lesson, you don't want a dry face. You just want a damp face. Is there an actual difference in my cheeks? Like, can you guys actually tell? I don't know, but I must admit, I haven't been getting a lot of acne. One, two, three drops is what I like. Here's my face, and I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I actually really enjoy it. It works, it, it legit works. I can't really tell you if I would recommend it to you because, like, I'm saying it works, but I need a little bit more time to really know because it could really just be the sunscreen that's working because I actually put sunscreen on today so I know the difference when I do put sunscreen on it probably is this that's working so anyways I thank you guys so much for watching I really hope you guys enjoyed this video I've heard many great things about gum molecules and those great things are true I have oily skin but again it's just about the dark marks and again nothing's gonna be gone in one week so I don't even know when the last time it looked this good for real I don't know anyways I'm gonna give you guys an update three weeks clock it and I had to catch you guys in the next video.